the way. It's completely random. It's either nothing, except teams, or a game. And so there were five games, so now there's only five games left. And a lot of septims. Alright, strategy, strategy. It's not like I have a lot. Depending on what she does, maybe a little reflect, even though it's 10%, it's not much, but that could come in handy. These are scrolls that I keep just in case. That could be quite useful, actually. And then for my spells, I'm going to levitate, might, might help. A billion septims, not that many. But remember, with 2,000 septims, you can name the dragon. Like, I want to name the dragon, but I thought someone would like to. Apparently, I'm the only one who cares about giving a name to the dragon. Summon a greater born walker. That's not going to do a lot of damage, honestly. But we'll try. Eyes of the Khajiit is not going to help. Fear strike, we know, does nothing. Keen eyes, we don't need that. Do I have Mesmerize? Cast Shadow Form when I panic. <laughs> My V. Soothe Humanoid. And, you know, that could work. To give me time to recover. Alright, we'll try. Uh, before that. Definitely. The dragon should be able to pick his own name. The dragon is not you know programmed to pick his own name whoa there's two of them are you kidding me and she has a crossbow all right one of them is not doing anything that's good i guess oh that bolt really hurt Oh wow, that is messy. Let's have the reflect. <sighs> like, how many? What? How many of them? And I was, you know, I was like, oh, I shouldn't have my companions with me. It's really quite unfair. There's four of them. And one of their balls pretty much kills me. Are you kidding me? At that rate, I'm never going to have enough potions. Like what? Summon all my companions. Do it. Can you see that? I'm never going to survive this. Where's that invisibility thing that I thought I could use, you know, in case of emergency? I believe this is an emergency. Okay. Right. That was... Um... Oh, thank you so much for the host. Much appreciated. Thanks a lot for the host, Slaggy Badger. First death. Zach, oh no, you came back just to see me die. <sighs> but you'll have to admit, it's totally unfair. Honestly. It's like there's four or five of them. We'll try again. But this time I'm, I'm calling in my companions straight away. summon all my companions and and I did did say at the beginning I only have spot because spot is amazing um, follow me even inside please I'm gonna need you is by far the strongest of my companions Jasmine Jasmine she has she has a good bow, a good crossbow, a really good crossbow. She has arrows, bolts, lots of healing potions. Hopefully she'll use them. Arnand. Arnand wants to have a quick word. 
Better not call up your fighter to save the day. Yes, about that. I um, I told Indiana James to, to go back where he came from. So he went back to Cyrodiil. I felt quite bad, you know, juggling between Arnand and, and Indiana James. So there you have it. Let's have a quick word. Maybe it's something we've... Pack your bag, gorgeous. We're going camping. No, 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 no. I'm really in the middle of something. Oh, sorry, Arnand. I'm so sorry. But we, we have a fight to fight. So please follow me. Just, uh, you know, I don't want you to be sad. Jasmine, you're with me? Yes. I'm not even sure I can win that fight. Yes, I finally got rid of Indiana James. He's a little too strong. I mean, there's a couple of things. He's too strong. And, um, and he doesn't have a quest attached to him. Okay, now I'm wearing my best stuff. I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, in we go. I said, in we go. My journal's been updated. Pit, there seems to be more than one of her. What strange magi magic is at work here? Cheating magic. So she's got a drain on her. She's got a drain. Oh crap, I think she had a reflect there. Gone. I've got a sharp pain going on. This is my own spell. <sighs> wow. And he does come a bit strong personality-wise. Yes, he's a little bit pushy, let's say. I don't know that I can beat her right now. I really don't. more can I do? Um, do I have my death counter working properly? No, I do not. Mm, let me see. No, it's one of the things I did not reset. But, hotkey... Try that. No. Alright, death counter is not going to show us anything. Good. Anyone that walks in the stream and go, oh, this girl's good. She didn't die a single time. Okay, how do I beat her? Scrolls of Despair. I mean, I can walk up to her and use that. Let's go with that. Scroll of Ancestral Blizzard. I was doing fine up until I hit her and she had a reflect on. And then my own uh, drain spell was killing me, basically. And giving me all kinds of injuries as well. We said it is Scroll of Ancestral Blizzard. Let's do this. Let me, let me go in. I resisted the magic. You're kidding me. She has reflect. And I feel a sharp pain. I don't know if that's... Oh, one is dead. Okay. Like that one. 
That's good. My crime has been reported. Are you kidding me? What crime? I'm not sure. This one has reflect, damn it. No potion of dispel when I need them. Oh my goodness. Do I have a song of dispel? <laughs> I don't know. Nullify. Yes. Okay, her reflect is wearing out. Wearing out, wearing off. I hope my companions are... My crime has been reported, I hate that. Hopefully it's just um, something in the script. Come on, die. Okay, she should be dying quite soon. It's definitely <laughs> a magic character. There's four of them. Uh, and when she has reflex, well, that's really bad news for me because all I can do is use my spell song to drain her life. How are you doing, companions? You're doing okay? And right now, I'm getting the pain because of her reflect, I think. But you... Oh, come on. You're doing okay. Okay. No reflect, that's good. I don't want to target my friends. She's dead. My journal's updated. I have defeated the witch hunter. Okay, that's good. But do I have a zillion bounty on my head? That's um, hopefully it's just with a script and then it goes away. Oh, bummer. <laughs> bummer, bummer. I mean, I think I have the money to pay it. I do. But it's totally unfair. Why should I? Um, the quest line is from a mod called The Trouble with Millie. Which so far has been a rather fun mod to play. I am not sure if it's okay for me to loot the multiple bodies. Okay, that was not the real body. Is there going to be the real body somewhere? And whatever that spell is, the, the clone spell, I definitely want it. In the end, not a single body. All right, so I'm going to get out of there with a place filled with ordinators. Brilliant. I guess I really ought to teleport. And as long as I don't talk to them, they're not going to do... They're not going to do anything to me. Unless my bounty is too high. I don't know. Uh, is that a, a school teacher? Mm, of sorts. Yes, you can say that. I'm going to teleport. And the way I'm going to do that is... I'm going to use my amulet so my companions can follow me. Advert your eyes. My guild guide is naked. Fortunately, she's also very furry. Take me, take me to the small cave, because then I have the tunnel. Eee, there we go, to Balmora. You knew it. <laughs> if you have a huge amount of ordinators, is that an inordinate amount of ordinate? <laughs> that's, that's almost a philosophical question there, Onion. All right. Um, I am... 
I believe I am a member of the Thieves Guild because when I was trying to do the the Camelot on quest, I was trying to get information from them. Is there someone in uh, in Balmora in the Thieves Guild that can uh, remove? I'm an idiot. Actually, I'm gonna go home. I have an agent, and I think he should be able to remove the bounty. I'm gonna try the Thieves Guild first. Played hide and seek with the guards. Hydrate and save. Let's do both. <clears throat> and I have a 2k bounty. Ah, numbers don't work. <laughs> it's a K bounty. It's short for OK. Um, I, I do remember where the, the Thieves Guild is, but I'm not sure that there's someone who can remove my bounty there. I know Toad, Toad Tongue, Tongue Toad, in Alderaan can do that, but um, yes, definitely want to join so that I can um, have a price on my head. No, price on my head, thank you. All right, here's the one. We're friends. I, I gave him a skirt to wear. You remember me? Good friends. Yes, I do have. I'll pay it. Okay. All right, good. Really unfair because, you know, I my mission was actually to kill her. But, oh well, it's done. Okay, let's go and talk to our friendly orc and tell her that the death threat on her has been removed because, well, we think, <laughs> we think she's dead. Even though of the three corpses, three or four corpses, none of them stayed there. Oh well. I am a toad, yes. And that alone is a good reason to level up. Just to get a rank or two, because Toad is not, not the best title I want. You know, it doesn't go with Baroness and Toad. If I go to Sadenin, I should see if I have um, a new rank, by the way. You handle that witch hunter well. I have something for you. Scroll of Summon Golden Saints, yes. And three Grand Soul Gems, that's nice. Welcome. That's very nice indeed. How are you? Arnand, you wanna go you wanna go camping now, maybe? Quick word. Sure. He kisses me, hold on tight. Whew. And he swooshed me away in an Ashlander tent. This man knows me not so well. I mean, Arnand, have you visited my house? It's a, it's a palace with the luxurious things ever. All right, Arnand, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. Can I have a quick word? Of course. Now, if you're going to talk to me, you're going to take off your dorky helmet. Thank you. Yeah, much better. Okay. Okay, there's something I would like to ask you. I've switched the communicator off so we won't be interrupted. Yeah, the last time he tried to talk to me, his sister called. That was a little awkward. Uh, all right. Oh, sounds serious. At least it didn't start with, we have to talk. Sounds serious. Well, I guess it is. You and I have known each other f a while now, even discounting you know, when we were younger, which you seem to have forgotten about. Yes, it's a bit awkward. Anyway, where was I? Oh, yes. <clears throat> what are you trying to say? I'm really not helping if, uh, <laughs> if I keep interrupting him. What I mean is, you know, that I am a Breton Orthodox, right? I thought you were a hoppist monk. That was a conversation before, and uh, he had to make up a story explaining he was a hoppist monk. It was very funny. 
wait, you really didn't think that. <laughs> but that was just Arnand. I know that you're a Breton Orthodox. Oh good, right, I'm a Breton Orthodox and our religion has certain ceremonies that we go through in our lives as both a celebration of our devotion to the Nine and to count certain important times in our lives like new birth and at the end of our lives, funerals. <laughs> oh no, who died? No, Aureliana, nobody died. Sheesh, I'm only trying to bloody propose to you. I'm sorry. You know, you and me, big hitching ceremony. Only we call it the ritual of joining. But it's the big formal dress, vows, piss up and speeches thing. Now, let's start again. Aureliana, yes. I don't just follow you around for hours on end for the good of my health. I'm completely in love with you. It's a good thing uh, I got rid of Indiana James. That would be awkward, you know, with one guy calling me darling. I'm so happy to go on adventures with you. And him proposing that that would have been really, really awkward. I'm completely in love with you and want to be with you for the rest of my life. Now, do you want to be with me for the rest of your life? And finally, I can say yes, without, you know, lying. <laughs> oh, good. I was really hoping that you'd say that. Here, Arnon slips a ring onto your finger and gives you a slow, lingering kiss. I have Arnon's ring in inventory and my journal's been updated. Sorry, I'm such a girl. I have to check the ring. That's what's happening. I'm looking for the most beautiful ring and I'm not seeing a particularly Arnon's ring. I don't know, it's uh it's not the prettiest ring out there. Honestly, look at that. Caius gave me a ring, it's prettier. Or, you know, I I've I've found this one in a cave, it's prettier. I don't know, Arnand. And the enchantment. 20 points for 10 seconds on self. I feel a little bit cheated. Nonetheless, Arnand, can you take us back? We call with me home. Or set up camp? No. I mean, where are we? Azura's coast region. That's where he took me. Wow. That's a little far from uh, <laughs> from where I was. But let you say, I did say yes eventually, okay? That's what mattered. And, and when he asked, I barely hesitated and all that. Okay, can you take us home? Let me, let me quick save. Recall with me. Yes, let's go to your house in Balmora. There we are, in his house. And the door that disappeared all this time ago. Hello, Max. I don't have rat meat, I'll pet you. Uh, if you remember a long, long time ago, when I was uh, doing the, the quest with Arnand, he invited me to his place, we went to his place, and then he say, well, if you just go downstairs, and this trap door, was nowhere to be seen. I promise you, nowhere. So we never did see the scene where he took me to bed and he lied there. It was, uh, it was quite a thing. For now, let's get out of here and find Jasmine before she realizes we were gone, you know, camping and all that. Noble Sledge is a rather rare flower. I got a feeling that a number of NPC just fell there uh, because the mod adds the, the docks along the river and the NPCs with the path grid didn't take that into account so at some point they fell and they got stuck. <laughs> and did I see someone in the water? I did see someone in the water. Sorry people. That's why 
gradually there are fewer and fewer NPCs in uh, in Balmora. It's because they all fell on the decks, on the docks, and they just don't know how to come back. Anyway, I have talked to Sean. I believe I can now go back to Millie who hopefully is going to reward me with lots and lots and lots of money to make up for the bounty I have to pay. Well, the price I had to pay to remove the price on my head. Same difference, I think. Alright, Millie, what do you have to say? Hey, Millie. You have been a fine friend and protector, Aureliana. Sean Juan Muscop is enthralled with you now. Good work. How about doing a courtesy for me? Well, of course. Are you ready to do me a courtesy? Oh, you know, you know. I love helping you. Very good. Well, the witch hunter you defeated has a brother. He is in town seeking restitution. The guild guide saw him and spoke with him briefly. You should go talk to her. Oh crap, another fight I won't be able to win on my own. Arnand, you with me? And I probably should find uh, Spot and Jasmine. I believe I left them in the in the guild of mages. Athletics, nice. I need to remember when I go home to practice my long blade and blunt. As they are both skills for the Imperial Legion. I am her main supporter, yes, possibly her only supporter. Here we are. Why aren't you following me nicely? Are you over encumbered? Of course they are over encumbered because they were fighting the, you know, see, sorry, I'm, I'm going from one thing to another. That's a ring I gave him. Okay, the name is quite horrible, Five Fingers of Fane. Mm. But the ring is pretty. Anyway, let's be serious. Can you restore your own state of health? Take a health potion? No. Crap, you can't restore your own attributes. Jasmine. Jasmine will be able to restore her own attributes. Yeah, I know, I agree, Onion. The, the, the name is terrible, but the ring is pretty. Okay, hopefully, yes, she has restored her strength. Onion, you do not know to restore your own stats. Wait, I might know something. Ailment resistance, no. Song of Restoration is for myself. I could use it actually. Okay, that's good for me. Ailment resources, elemental weakness, magical talent, mesmerize, lunify. Done. I might have to, I don't know, learn a spell because right now he's unable to move because his strength is down to, or you can move. So your strength is good. All right, problem solved. And we need to talk to the guild guide. <laughs> Hello, Grabler. Welcome to the stream. And you want to tell me about the brother Brother, 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 brother. Witch hunter's brother. Yes, I spoke with him. Apparently he is unaware that his sister was after Sean, but he may recognize you from his questioning people at the arena bit. His name is Sol Stalin. He mentioned he was going to camp out along the river west of town, which would put mm. us close to the mine. Possibly, we'll see. My bard can't have worm yet already. I hope not, we're just barely engaged. I don't 
Don't go away on it. There. Sure, 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 sure. Passion. 